There's a trick in my show that I've been doing for a long time called reverse logic. And I came up with this trick based on the simple premise of a card trick done backwards. It's not that your card is gone. It's that your card has gone back in time. Thank you so much. I'm now wearing the watch that I took off three minutes ago. A lot of card tricks you do close up, but very few play big on a stage for 50 or 100 or 300 people. Reverse logic plays. It's a short routine, about three minutes long, but there are six moments of magic. There's visual magic, and there's cerebral magic in it. And it all starts with a crystal clear, interesting premise. I wanna do a card trick backwards. And you do. You make a watch jump back on your wrist. You make a deck of cards go back into order after it's been shuffled by a spectator. There's adventure along the way. There's an intriguing premise. There's interaction with a spectator. And it all pays off with a spectacular ending. Reverse logic can go anywhere in your show that you need it to. You can plug it right in. I find it works great as an opener. And I find that now my favorite place to use it is as the second trick. It's got great energy, it's punchy, but it's got a premise, and it works so well in the second spot. Even though I've been doing this trick for years, I've never released it to magicians for two reasons, really. The first one is I'm still using it. I do this trick in every parlor show that I do. And the other reason is it involves a lot of stuff. But we've finally done the work. You get everything that you need to perform this trick. And here's the best part. It's really easy to do. I didn't design this trick or any of my tricks with ease in mind, but this trick happens to work itself. The props take care of everything, so the watch that vanishes and reappears basically is magic to you as well. What that allows you to do is live and breathe in the performance and not think about the technique of the trick. When you come up with a trick, it's like an old friend or, or your baby, and it's hard to let go. But in this case, I'm just really excited for you to try this trick out. I use this trick all the time. I love doing it. I'm proud of it. I love the premise that it sets up, and I hope it serves you well in your show.